How long have you been recording? <laughs> I just turned it on before I sat there. Check their mics. Just check, make sure you hear them okay. Now there's three open spots. Got them both. Sure. Rolling and recording. Five, four, three, two, one, and here we go. We are rolling and recording. Alright, unmute the microphones and fade the music out now. Good evening and welcome again to Public Perspective. Excellent. I'm your host Kevin McDermott and tonight we have as our guest, a friend of the show, someone who's been on a couple of times before, we have the President of the Metropolitan Water Reclamation District, Marianne Skaropoulos. Marianne, thank you so much for coming back on the show. Thank you Kevin, uh, it's always a pleasure to be here. Well, uh, people take water for granted, don't they? Absolutely. And so they don't know where it comes from. They don't know where it goes to, mm -hmm. and they don't know how that cycle works all the way through. Right. Um, but I think this is particularly relevant uh, because water, the water rack, uh, moves the water right. after we use it. Um, you know, we have to tweak things here and there, um, but I like to think that we're, you know, Somebody we're doing away a good job. Well, it sounds like we are. Yeah. <laughs> um, so you, uh, you brought along some, some photos that we can take uh -oh. a look at. Right? Oh, yes. All right. Visuals. Yes. So uh, we'll ask if our crew can cue those up and okay. we'll, uh, we'll talk about them as they come up. Okay. Right. So um, first one we've got up here is... Uh, oh, the so that Go is our two. Stickney um, water reclamation plant located in the town of Cicero. Uh, and, and it's the town yeah, of Stickney that? That where it gets its name. Yeah. Correct. And it's um, one of the... It is the largest back. treatment plant, um, wastewater treatment plant in the world. We get guests from all over the world who want to come and see uh, the various processes. Everything, all the solids and liquids come to this plant. They get separated. Um, the the liquid stuff? gets cleaned up to about 96% oh, of um, And tilted. then it becomes effluent when so it is um, released from bit. our plant. And what's the, the definition of effluent? Effluent's not 100% clean. Okay. It's about 96%. Five gallons? <laughs> yes. Because, you know, you, you're the process mm -hmm. just running while you're sitting there brushing your teeth, and it keeps running and running, mm -hmm. and it's all going into the, the wastewater. Right. Um, another thing is when you're going to take a shower, you turn on the shower to warm it up before you get in there. Put a bucket um, there to capture that water until you're ready to go in. Another five gallons of water. Um, that you're saving from going down the drain. Okay, it doesn't sound like a lot, but just but think of. Up. But just think of if everybody did that, and everybody's just started shifting the way that they thought about, you know, water and, um, you know, let's say you have a half-empty bottle of water at a party or something instead of, uh, you know, throwing it down the drain, you know, put it in a plant or something. Well, I can't think of better advice. That's a great way to wrap up. Mariana, thank you so much for being on the show again. And Thanks, we'll Kevin. Have you back after you're reelected. We'll have you back and we can talk about the future some more. Right. Thanks so much. You're welcome. And thank you for joining us once again on Public Perspective. I'm your host, Kevin McDermott. You can find us every Saturday night at 8 on Comcast Channel 19 and find us on the web at publicperspective.tv. So until next time, thank you and good night. Here it comes. sound and we're out. That's a wrap.